Okay, in this problem we're asked to find the general differential dg and then we're asked to approximate the change in g if x1, x2, x3 is initially at p equals 6, 1, 0 and it changes by delta u, v, w equals 0, 0, 0, 0.03, negative 0, 0.01 and 0, 0.01. And we're given that the initial, that our function g of u v w is equal to u squared v minus e to the power of negative v w squared. Okay, so the general differential dg is equal to the partial derivative of g with respect to u times du plus the partial derivative of g with respect to v times dv plus the partial derivative of g with respect to w times dw. So first we're going to we're going to find the partial derivative of g with respect to u and then v and then w. So the partial derivative of g with respect to u is just two u v. The partial derivative with respect to v is u squared plus w squared e to the power of negative v w squared. And the partial derivative of g with respect to w is equal to 2vw times the power to the power of negative v w squared. And that's dw. So this is our general differential. And we're going to want to find the general differential at the point 6, 1, 0. Find that the first term is just 12 du. Second term is 36 dv. And the third term is 0. And now we're going to approximate the change in g if our change in u v w is given by this vector. So we can just take the du and dv to be the change in u and the change in v. So we'll just plug in 0 0.03 for du and negative 0 0.01 for dv. And we get that the result is zero. So the approximate change in G, if you change UVW at 
with respect to this vector and at the point P is expected to change by nothing. 